Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got another update for the 2020 Vision Project. Um, we've been doing it for almost a year, so I'm sure you guys know, but just in case, this was organized by Elizabeth, who is Cookie Pants on Instagram, Hayley, who is Makeup Tips 102 on Instagram, and Paula, who is a beauty guru, made me do it on Instagram and on YouTube. The idea of this one is that we've got 20 beauty products and 20 makeup products that we're trying to finish off before 2020 starts. Um, yeah, we don't have that much time anymore and I've still got quite some work to do, but let's take a look at what I've been doing. So first of all, the quick one, um, the Rimmel Apocalypse Lip Lacquer in Apocalyptic. Wearing it right now. I do really love it, so I should wear it a little bit more maybe, but as I've said before, I'm trying to focus on so many things at the same time. This is not my main focus right now. Although seeing this on my lips, maybe I should wear it a little bit more because I actually really like it. Um, yeah, so I'm wearing it now. That's the only time I've worn it, so not too much progress. It's pretty much impossible to see what I'm doing with this one anyway, progress-wise. I don't think I will be able to finish this by the end of the year, but I might be able to at least use it a little bit more often. So might make that a goal for next time to use it like at least five times or so. That would be nice. Um... Okay, so I quickly wanted to show you guys as well, because what I've been doing the last few times is use it every time I film a video, so at least I've used it once, but I kind of forgot that this time. So just as a reminder, some products that I have not used that are still left in here um, are this black eyeshadow. I know. Um, yeah, I'm not even going to talk about that for too much longer. The lip balm, I love coconut and cream, which is like huge and... I'm still focusing on our lip balm, so this is not going to be used right now. And then we've got the pigment. I have actually used this once or twice, I think. Why is this in my I haven't used pile? Um, yeah, so I've used it like in my inner corner, so there, <laughs> there is no progress, but I've used it. So that's good. Um, I'm getting close to using up kind of my highlighting colors in my Panda palette, so I'm hoping I can bring this one in a little bit more soon. Ugh. Them, they're a little bit far away. Um, we've got the Catrice uh, eyeshadow in Help I'm Stranded, and I'm using the darker color in here, or at least I'm trying to use the darker color. I'm not really using it because um, I've still got some darker colors in my Panda palette, of course. And then the highlighter um, this is the nurse highlighter that I'm trying to use as well, but again. Well, actually, I think I might have used it once or something as well, just because I felt like this went better with my eye look than the highlighter that I'm wearing right now. But not really any progress on this one either. So, yeah, that is it for those products. Now let's go to the more interesting part. Um, more makeup products. The lip balm that I am focusing on a lot, since I'm not focusing on that coconut one, is the Pow Polish from Sleek, uh, from the Avril Lafesh collection in Sugar May. And I am getting really close on this one. So my goal is to try and focus on this one a good bit over the next month. And then I hope I can either finish it or get really, really close. So in the next one or two months, this one will be gone. I, I'm i not going to promise because I'm never 100% certain. But like I'm, I'm, I'm really going to try to get that done. So kind of excited about that because I've been working on that one for a full year. It is huge. There is... 10 grams or 0.34 ounces of product in here which just is a lot especially in a product product like that so then another product that I started using finally is my elf blush as you guys probably know I used up the blush that was in my Too Faced glamour to go palette in like some of my other projects I've been working on that for a long time as well but now I am kind of trying this one in the mix I've got another blush that is my main focus but I've used this one I think about 10 times or so, which is not enough to make a new mark. So I've got a mark right here and there isn't a whole lot happening with this apart from that, like marking wise, but I've used it. So I'm excited about that. I finally started using this and I hope by the end of the year, at least there will be some difference. You can see that I've been using it. That's, that's what we're going for right now. Another one that I've started using as well is this Gosh On Stage Cool Lip Jam. Um, and this one is in 101, doesn't mean anything, they don't sell them anymore, so um, yeah, it's okay, it's very sticky, I kind of knew that, but I forgot about that, it smells like bubblegum, which is kind of nice, um, yeah, and there is a whole lot of products in here, this is 15 mils in a tube, um, which is 0.5 fluid ounces, in case you want to know that as well, 
so big. Um, so we'll see how far I will get with this. But I'm using it and I made a teeny tiny bit of progress. At least enough to make a new marking, so that's good. I did start using my Kruidvat <laughs> lip gloss as well, which was like the red one. Mm, this tends to become kind of a trend, something that comes up more often. Put it in my pocket, cycle to work, wasn't there anymore when I arrived at work. So that is the second lip product that I lost that way. So maybe I need to pay more attention when I'm putting things in my pocket. Uh, make sure that the pockets are big enough so stuff doesn't actually fall out. So I didn't use that one up, but it's not in the project anymore. Don't know if that's a good or a bad thing, but mm. anyway, trying to use this one more now, the fact that that red one is gone makes that easier to do as well, because I have less things that I'm trying to focus on, so eh, it's a good and a bad thing at the same time, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, um, I'm hoping that by next time I have a good bit more progress on here, because this one is going to be my main focus um, Yeah, for the next month. And those were my makeup products. Um, then I still have the one beauty item that I'm working on as well. This is the Image Skincare Clear Cell uh, Clarifying Pads. And I am right there right now. So, I don't know, I think I'm about like halfway. There still is a whole lot left in here. I do like using them. They seem to kind of help with drying out the things that I want to try out and make sure they go away a little bit quicker but I just think it's a hassle to use them and there's so much of them. It takes so long to get through it. But yeah, um, still working on it. Don't think I'm gonna be finishing this one by the end of the year, but we'll see. So just to kind of wrap things up and make some sort of a plan, I'm gonna use this one a lot over the next month and hopefully get very close to finishing this one off. Then I'm gonna try and use this one a little bit more as well you won't be able to see any progress probably because the top part is black but I want to be able to tell you guys that I've used it at least five times let's let's see that sh should be possible um, the blush I am using more so I'm kind of hoping by next time at least I can make a mark but I don't know we'll see and then also like I said this lip gloss I'm starting to use more as well there only is a teeny tiny bit of progress this time but I'm hoping by next time there is like a proper new marking on here that is a little bit more below the one that I have now and that's it that is it for now thank you guys very much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video bye bye